let's get to planting these potatoes in the bottom of the container here I've got holes about two inches up that way no more than two inches of water will sit in the bottom and then I usually put sand in but it's kind of mixed with sand and soil right now from last year It's filled up to about the third line, which is about three inches of soil. Because potatoes themselves, when they grow, they don't grow down. They grow from the top and then grow over the sides of the potato. And with gravity, even if a sprout comes up from the bottom, it's still going to grow up and produce potatoes left and right of the top of the tuber. So. You don't really need a lot of soil on the bottom. All your soil goes in the top. And then this is a purple fingerling. I sent um, Lyle at um, No Hippie Barbecue um, two or three of these, and then one of um, the exotic potatoes that I grew last year. And the difference between these, these are seed potatoes, and then like two videos ago when I was talking about true potato seeds. Those are teeny tiny little seeds like a tomato has teeny tiny little seeds inside of a berry. So there's a difference in some of the videos that I've been showing you on potatoes. But with this one, let me bring you a little closer to see in the bucket. Okay. If you put a couple inches of soil in, I'm just going to space the purple Peruvians. Um, put one in the center and then let's see four like this and cover with probably about four inches of soil and as the plant grows up I'll continue but um never over eight to ten inches of soil above them because I don't think they can grow higher than eight to ten inches up the stalk. I'm going to take the rest of the soil and put in this grow bag that's probably five, six, seven gallons. Go ahead and roll it down because I'm just going to put some in and then hold it up later. Let's see how potatoes do. This is one of the regular potatoes. See how rooted up it is? It's one of the Mennonite potatoes. It's ready for going in the ground. But here's Russian banana. I'm gonna put it one, two, three, four. Yes. We'll go ahead with five Russian bananas, one in the center. Let me show you the position. There's five of them in this bag. And then put it. That's about it. Once they start growing, then I'll unroll the bag as, just the same way I'm rolling it up and add more soil to it. And we'll see how many we get from five Russian bananas, fingerlings. And 
and this is what they look like planted. I've got the soil, let's see, about this line right here on the bucket full, and plenty of room to hill up after they start growing. This one on the grow bag, I've got my hand um, up to here in the soil with the potatoes underneath. And then as they grow, I'll continue hilling up. You can also go ahead and just, you know, put them at that level and fill the bag up. But it's going to take a lot of energy for the um, tuber to get all the way up into the top of the soil. But that's a personal choice whether you want to do it like that or hill them up as they grow. Thank you all for coming to my garden today. I hope you have a wonderful day. See you later. Thank you.